Hey guys, I am back on Pensacola Beach just checking out some things, what's changed and you know anything that might be updated and that sort of thing. So I'm just, I just want to bring you along and share with you because I know some of you are very excited for your upcoming trips and you're making plans and you want to know and see everything about Pensacola Beach. So let's go check it out. Well, my journey first takes me to the Pensacola Beach Gulf Pier, and I just love piers. I don't know what it is. I don't mind paying the cost to walk on the pier. There's a fishing pass and a walking pass to come out here, but it actually is one of my favorite places to take pictures at the beach. It's such a different perspective than walking on the sand in the beach, so I would just want to, I mean, how can you not love a pier? <laughs> It's so beautiful out here. We do see wildlife. There's pelicans and birds, and of course there's sea life. We've seen a turtle and sharks, of course, uh, fish and dolphins. It's been amazing. So I always like coming out here. A lot of people come out to fish and um, you see that throughout the entire day, but it's just a gorgeous, gorgeous view. And I noticed walking back that looks like they're gonna be doing some replacing of the wooden panels along the walking path because it is a little bit old and some ragged parts so I appreciate that they're making some updates to this pier and of course I can't leave this area without visiting Casino Beach amazing fun little beach but obviously nothing much has changed here <laughs> it's just really pretty so I have to include that in my video Right, right across the street from Pensacola Beach is the boardwalk. They do have a trolley that runs in evening time that has a stop right here on the boardwalk, which is really convenient. So we're gonna take a look at the boardwalk, anything here that has been updated. It's just, um, it really is a fun place to come and walk. Have you guys ever been to this Kilwins ice cream and treats shop? It looks so yummy. I don't think I've ever bought anything here, but it's right on the boardwalk and it's really convenient. Of course, anytime you're on vacation, you want something sweet and yummy. This is a perfect spot. And of course, right across is Bamboo Willies. They redid their patio, the roof, it looks really great. And of course, they have a great view of the Soundside beaches and very yummy, a wall full of yummy, delicious drinks. All right, we're gonna head over to Pensacola Beach Marina and I love coming over here and checking things out. They do have a fun double-decker pontoon. It's a tiki pontoon and they also have, you know, fishing charters and dolphin cruises and all that. And I really love these circular tiki boats. They're so cute. Uh, they look so small when they're out in the bay, but it's a fun little ride and I'm glad that they have those here. And here's that double-decker tiki pontoon. All right, and we're gonna head down the marina just a little ways. They have a lot of different fishing charters and dolphin tour companies down here. So if you just walked on here, you can find that information or find it online. I did try Chase and Finn's dolphin cruise and I can say they did a great, great job. It was a lot of fun.
Well, it is spring and we were promised a Fairfield Inn and Suites and it looks like it is getting close to being done. Not quite there yet, but it is gonna be a great addition to our hotels. And what's interesting is right in front of this hotel, there's an old liquor store and there are plans now to replace that with a new building, which will be really nice. Well, I'm in the mood for some more beach, so I'm gonna take you down Via de Luna. We're gonna go all the way down to the Portofino Towers, which is the east side, the farthest building on the east side of Pensacola Beach. They do have a public beach access and walk over to the beach. Let's go to the beach. And these buildings are always just super impressive. I just can't get over it. But I am just really excited to show you the beach over here. So let's hop on over. And we're gonna head over to Park West, one of my favorite public parks right on the Gulf. All right, and Park West is the edge of Pensacola Beach, right next to the Gulf Island National Seashore. And we're gonna head over to Fort Pickens down this road. I love this little road. It's one of my favorite things to do in the morning, on the weekends, take my coffee and drive along this road. There's a couple of parking lots right alongside the Gulf, so you can park and look at the beautiful ocean. I like this one, it's very flat and you can see right to the Gulf, it's pretty amazing. And you can tell you're getting closer to Fort Pickens because of the road, there's trees, and the terrain changes this a little bit, but we're gonna go explore a little bit of Fort Pickens. And this is a fun, free thing to do. You can pay to have a tour, otherwise you can just wander around for free. And just across the bridge from Pensacola Beach is Gulf Breeze and they put in a new Chipotle and first watch which is great for breakfast. And lastly you guys, Pensacola Bay Bridge is finally open on both sides. Going to and from Gulf Breeze to Pensacola, we have three lanes going across the bridge. It is absolutely wonderful. I've never been so happy to have a new bridge in my life, but this is great. It's gonna really help the summer traffic. And that's gonna do it for my update today. You guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon.